Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will learn about the max operator. So this is also one of the comes under mathematical and aggregation operators category. Now let's try to learn about this max operator. What is this max operator? As the name itself indicates that you will be able to understand that max means it will give you the maximum. Maximum is the highest value what is the present in the list of values that is emitted by the source observable. So, if, a, if an observable is emitting the values, so it will give you the highest value that is emitted by the source observable. Now, if you try to see here, the max operator operates on an observable that emits numbers or items that can be compared with the provided function. So, this is also a defa default one, not default one, optional one. And when source observable completes it and emits a single item, the item with the largest value. That means whenever a source observable is emitting the values, it will give you the largest value out of all those values present in that observable, it will give you the largest value. Now, if you try to see here the syntax max, so if you have, uh, there is an optional uh, parameter that is comparer. So, that means if you want to compare anything means you can also use, you can also use this compare thing. I will show you when we will be using this comparer function. <coughs> now, here if you try to see the marble diagram, here we are having a source observable, it is emitting the values. 42 minus 1 and 3. So, these are the values that is emitted by the source observable. And if you try to see if we pass this observable to the max operator, it will be giving you the largest value that is present in the list of values. So, now here what is the value present the largest value? The 42. So, that is the reason 42 has been emitted to the output observable. So, this is about the max operator. Let us try to see the practical implementation of this one. I am creating ngGC pages slash max operator. So, let us create it by the then I will open operators dot html and here I will use <coughs> max and here also I will use max and uh, here I will open app routing and here in this app routing what I will try to do is here I will add max and here also I will use max operator component. Let us open this one. So, it is taking some time to create a component. Now, it has been created. Now, if you try to see max operator component, yeah. Now, let us go to the implementation of this max operator. Now, here in this one, let us say that we have a source. Let source dollar is equal to OF of and we are displaying the values OF of yeah we will be having value something like comma 100 comma minus 1 comma 34 something like this we are having some set, set of values now what i will try to do i will try to subscribe this one and i will do console.log data and here what i can do is i can apply the pipe operator and i can pass <coughs> max so like this we can pass operator we can apply directly max now it will give you the maximum uh, largest value what is the largest value present in the list of observables now if i try to go and here if i try to see the output let's try to see the output here now if we go in the console now in the operators so if we go down max now we got 100 as the output why because 100 is the largest value that is present in the list in the source observable now we can also use the comparer function so in which scenarios we can use this comparer function is for example let's say that i will comment out this one and here let's take one persons is equal to it is an array and here you are having something like leela and the age is 20 okay and another one what you can see is another value we will take we will take another value oh sorry I have completely copied this one instead of one object. Yeah. Now here let's think that we have Matthew and this one is something around 30. Okay. And we can take another value something like John. And here I can keep something like 10. So these are the list of persons. Let's assume that. So the person who is having the ma uh, maximum age is the Matthew. So now what I can do here I can use this source observable something like of of i can use this of and i can pass this persons one by one okay using the spread operator and i can subscribe to this one 
and I can use the console.log data. So if I do this console.log data, all the person's values will be printed. But I want to get the person who is having the largest age. So max age, who is having the maximum age, I want to get. So if I apply like this maximum, we cannot do it. Now here we need to add a comparer. So comparer will take the first one is the previous person. Okay. And another one is the current person. Now you, <clears throat> now what I can do is here, I can apply in a such a way that previous person dot age okay is less than current person dot age if it is equal to then minus 1 take into consideration or otherwise 1 so that's it so this is a comparer function so minus 1 means it will exclude or 1 means it will take into consideration so again it will take it in the previous person now if i try to see the output if i click on the max again see we got the math as the 30 if you want the same thing means I can use something like greater than then previous person greater than means then you will get the person with less age who has the least age age 10. So like this we can use this comparer function previous person and the current person using using this one so we can we can calculate the uh, we can calculate the we can do it for the objects also. So we can get the uh, person for the uh, we can get the, the maximum uh, maximum value for, the, for an object also this is all about the max. So we can use this comparer function or otherwise if you simply pass the max means it will give you the largest value from the list of values that are present in the source observable. So hope you understood about this max operator. So if you have any doubts or any suggestions, please post the comments below to this video. And if you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.